So as I was making this Nearpod, I pulled into some of the photos that I have and everything online was like trying to sell me something and, and I didn't like that. So I decided to just take some pictures of my room where I have not gone into any kind of major expense to do lighting for my room. Um, above my head is this light. It is um, what we call down lighting. It's a ceiling light. And if I were to use that, it would light the top of my head and nothing else. So I actually don't have that lit when I'm teaching class. Oops, that's my salad I made. Isn't it healthy looking? Okay, so this lamp is just a standard lamp. It has a white shade. I have that to the right of me. And just like I said, I don't care what your room really looks like on a normal basis. There's my room. Okay, that's my office. <laughs> so yes, it doesn't look the greatest. I typically like to clean a little better, but that's the way it looks. Um, so that's to the right of my face. Then I have this up lighting. Um, the lamp on the top is up lighting. And what that does is it lights the ceiling above me without making it come right down on my head. So it's, it's what we call a diffused lighting because it's not like harsh. It's just kind of, uh, it's diffused, okay? Then I have this, which you may wonder why is there a piece of paper on it? Well, uh, I so this light, um, if that paper wasn't there, it would be a very harsh light and it would make the left side of my face more bright than the right side of my face. And once again, messy background, that's okay because you don't see that when I'm filming. Um, but all I had to do was tape a piece of paper. See, now I don't have it uh, taped to the hot part. I have it taped up here. Um, it does get a little warm, but uh, it stays on there fine. I used masking tape. And so that just diffuses the light a little bit so it's not so harsh. So I have light to my left that's diffused, light to my right that has a lampshade on it, so it's diffused. It's a white lampshade. And then I have a light that goes up toward the ceiling, and I don't use the light that's above my head. So if you can find a way to place some lighting in your room that is in front of you instead of behind you. And if you can find a way to maybe look in your basement for some lamps that nobody's using or maybe in an unused room just for that day, where you can kind of position them to your left and to, my, and to your right, then um, and toward the front of you, not directly to your right and left, but in front of you a little bit, okay? So uh, that's very helpful. I hope you can use that information to create some lighting today.